We're now going to attempt to make a plaque within the 2D. So first of all we're going to go to create a rectangle and use our left mouse button. I'm going to hold down the left mouse button and drag a big rectangle to the edge. In the box here we're going to type 380 and 280 and select create and then cancel. We then click somewhere outside of the box to make sure it's set into position. We just have to make sure that this rectangle here fits somewhere in this white sheet of paper. Now the next thing we're going to do is to draw some shapes inside here. So we're going to draw a rectangle at the top and we're going to come across and we're going to draw a star but we're going to do five sides this time so we change this number to five go to the middle and drag it out and then back in using that left mouse button we're going to do another one here and then another little one just down here and then right click to come out in this box at the top we're going to put some text so we're going to come to our text tool we're going to click on the box here and we're going to use 16 millimeters in height and you can select this box up here and we're going to select bank note we're going to start to type just here bloodhound and select this button here. We're just going to drag it roughly into the center. So here we have the start for our plaque design. Now we can start to draw some other things if we want. We can use the tools as you see here to draw different shapes. So we're drawing a rough shape of the Bloodhound car itself. Now this might not be the exact shape we want so we may want to edit these. So what we can do is select our shape and press the N or the N key, so the N on the keyboard and we can go to these little points here and we can move them around anywhere we want. And drag any of these little points to any shape, any position we want. Now there's lots of different things we can do with these. If we come onto this line here and press the B button, the B letter, we can move different parts around. If we come up to the top bit as well, we can do the same here. We can move different parts of our design. So we're going to move some of these points around to create a different design and shape. Now if we remember, we can use that B key on the keyboard and we can create what we call Bezier curves to create a nice smooth curve. can move the points out slightly more if we need to or drag more than one point across 
we can select our circles and we can move them into different positions as well. If we want to take a copy of this we can hold the control key down and drag it into a different location. Just going to create this end part on here by using that N key on the keyboard. So here we see we have a design for a simple 2D plaque.